Hey guys, so I've got a couple of things to talk about today and the first thing is the mystery prize that I mentioned a few videos ago. I already sent it out, I already uh, I found the winner randomly and I think her username was Alonso Got Lost and she's Irish and she makes some K-pop, J-pop unboxing videos and so if you're interested you can go check that out. But the point I want to make is that uh, when I was trying to find the prize, I wanted it to be for everyone and not just JE fans. And so I gave her a choice. I had something with Niski Doryo on it, or I had phone straps, and she chose the phone straps. So that means I still have this prize to give away because I originally bought this thing at um, a Kanjani 8 8 Uppers concert for my friend, but she no longer lives in Canada and I have no use for it, so I might as well just give it to someone who wants it. And so I'm gonna have to do this again. So if you want this thing with Nishikido Ryo on it, then just type Nishikido Ryo in the comments and I'll uh, randomly pick someone to send it out to. And next thing is uh, I recently pierced my ear, my right ear. Um, I originally only had my left ear pierced and that's because I only wanted one ear pierced but then I realized that I kind of want Sometimes I kind of want to have matching studs on both ears, and so I decided to pierce my right ear. But then the first time that I did it uh, on my left ear, it was really not that painful, and it seemed really easy. So I decided that instead of paying someone, I would pierce my own ear, which wasn't the best idea. <laughs> so I got this syringe needle, and I poked it through. It didn't hurt that much. And I tried to put the uh, stud in and it did not go in because the needle, the syringe needle made too small of a hole and so the stud could not fit through. And so I was freaking out because I had this open hole, open wound here and I did not want to get it infected. And so I was running around <laughs> trying to find something to, something thicker to poke through the hole. And I found a sewing needle which I used to poke through the hole again. And this time it hurt a little bit more but it's still not that bad. And so I tried to put in the stud again. It went through halfway but it, it could not get out through the back. And so I was freaking out because this hole has been open for I don't know how long. And um, so I just uh, used a lot of strength to try and jam the stud through the back and finally it popped out through the back and now my ear is pierced. The only thing I worry about is it getting infected now but it's already been a few days and it nothing had nothing has happened and so I, I hope that it's fine that nothing will happen but I definitely definitely do not recommend anybody doing this okay um, oh, uh, next Monday I will have my graduation ceremony, finally, because last, last week I got an email from my school saying that I, uh, they have checked all my marks and everything was okay and they approved my graduation. So finally I can graduate next week and hopefully I'll be able to take some clips there. Not that any, not that I think anybody would be interested because it's just graduation, it's nothing special. But nonetheless, I will try to take some clips. And I, I want some feedbacks for my videos because um, since I'm in Vancouver, there's, I've been here for many, many years. So there's nothing that I can really do here. I'm not going to go out like a tourist and just take random videos everywhere and show you guys. And there's really nothing interesting to see anyways. So I'm not going to do that like I did in Japan. So um, I've noticed that on YouTube that a lot of people really like watching other people show their stuff. Like people do haul videos, review of products, um, unboxing videos. And so because I have a lot of things to show here. And if I'm not really sure if you guys want to see them because they might not necessarily be interesting to everyone. So just, just let me know if you guys want to see those or or would you rather just watch me talk to the camera like I'm doing right now because when okay when I watch myself on uh, when I replay the videos and I watch myself I feel like I'm not that interesting but I don't know what you guys think so let me know just give me some feedback.
And finally, I just want to give a shout out to Emily because she said she wanted one. And um, seriously, Emily, you should really think about getting a YouTube channel because uh, you make really, really fun um, videos that I would love to watch. Um, yeah, so that's pretty much it for today. Thanks for watching. Bye.